Hello and welcome to a delightful part of Spain. We're here by the Mediterranean at the Estadio de la Ceramica. I'm Derek Ray and ready with his tactics board alongside me is Stuart Robson, my commentary partner. An action coming up from the Spanish top division, La Liga. It's Villarreal and they take on Rayo Vallecano. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. And here's a look at the starting 11 for Villarreal. So the 4-4-2 system relies on good combinations all over the pitch. The front two, the central midfield pairing, the fullback and winger, and of course the centre backs. If you can get these combinations right, you'll have a good team. Here's how it looks for Rayo Vallecano. Well, on paper, they look a very balanced team. But the three advanced midfielders must at times make runs beyond the centre forward. Otherwise, they might just lack a bit of penetration. And so the battle commences. Cease. Well, it was a foul, but good use of advantage by the referee. Oscar Trejo. Easy. And space to cross it. Moving the ball nicely, looking for that final pass. the kind of shielding play you expect from him Moreno might be able to set up the chance he must finish a goal in the early stages precisely what they had been planning well here's the replay he does well to find that bit of space in the box and then he shows a lot of composure to finish it off. That's a good goal. So the ball rolling again with the score line standing at 1-0. Oh, great defending. And that is going to be a free kick. Well, later in the game, he might have seen yellow, but not at this early point. Yeah, but I'm with the referee. It's a foul, but no card. Can he find someone at the far post? And it goes to square the game! What a contest this is turning out to be! Well, here's the replay, and it's a really inviting ball played into the box, begging players to attack it. And then what a great finish as well. Good connection with the ball, leaving the keeper with little chance. It's a great goal.
Back underway, level pegging, one goal apiece in this game. Alberto Moreno. Capu now. Gerard Moreno. Excellent defending. Chance to do damage. Well, he has the measure of his opponent, but stout defending when it mattered. Giovanni Lo Celso. And here's Gerard Moreno. Moreno. Now Parejo. Opportunity. And a goal to re-establish their advantage. Just look at the celebrations. Well, here it is again. He hits this so sweetly, doesn't he? That's a brilliant goal from a top-class player. So on with the match. 2-1 is the scoreline. What's going to happen next? Oscar Valentin. And now passing it through. Well, the pass in behind the defence. Quick thinking from the keeper. Parejo. Well, as you can see, Villarreal haven't enjoyed the majority of possession, but they've certainly shown an ability to counter-attack when they win it back. I expect more of the same. I think it's been a really good performance from them so far. More defending for them to do here, though. He's got to score! And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. It's a short corner. Now sliding in field. Garcia. Determined defending. Moreno. Now Parejo. Under pressure, doesn't seem to be bothering him. Morales. A danger here as he runs at them. Tremendously strong in the tackle. Parejo. Moreno. And offside by the merest of margins. And so it is, the first half has come to an end here at the Estadio de la Ceramica. You certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Stuart. Well, Derek, he took his goal well and was a constant threat throughout that first half. I thought he showed a lot of skill to get out of tight situations and he had a real impact on the plate. And so the second half is underway. Villarreal have the advantage. Nicely timed tackle. Falcao. He 
just failing to hit the target with his pass and it'll be a throw in Alberto Moreno and good pressure high up the pitch no shortage of excitement level again no wonder they're excited well let's see this again he tries to run out with the ball he has the ball taken off of him he's made the wrong decision and suddenly the ball's in the back of the net terrible defending Another equaliser. What a topsy-turvy game this has been. Morales. Lo Celso. How can they open up the defence here? And no problems at all for the keeper. Fran Garcia Oscar Trejo Now ruled to have taken up an illegal position only just We have 30 minutes to go. Through ball attempted, but completely overhit. Capu. Now Parejo. Moreno. Can he give them the advantage? In it goes! He's made it a brace for himself. No stopping him, apparently. Well, here's the replay, and it's a really good bit of play. Watch how he turns his marker and then has the composure to finish. That's a top-class goal. away again and we're being treated to plenty of goals 3-2 at the moment Fran Garcia well there you have it the away team have had so much of the possession but they've shown a real lack of invention today one or two of their more talented players need to step up now to get them back into this game Rosalso continues his run well, didn't go to plan in the end now options are plenty and they did have the ball but not anymore Valentin Falcao has it. Ten minutes to go then. Well, just listen to the noise in here. These fans are doing everything to get their team over the finish line. And there's not long left now. Now can they make something happen? Pavejo. Here's Moreno. 
Opportunity. And a goal to seal the hat-trick. A masterclass in finishing. Just can't stop him today. Well, let's take another look. And wow, how cleanly does he hit that? The keeper was never going to save it. What a good goal that is. Current scoreline 4 2. Oscar Valentin. We've had the official word. There will be a minimum of two added minutes. Valentin. Oscar Trejo. The referee blows for full time. It ends at a victory for the home team. No complaints from the fans here. Well, Derek, it was a comfortable win in the end. Fully deserved their victory because they dominated every aspect of the game. It was a really good result for them here today.